Tonight, authorities are reminding us all just how dangerous a laser pointer can be to a team up in the air. Last night, state police say a 12 year old used a laser pointer and pointed it towards the cockpit of one of its helicopters flying in Carroll County. 11 News reporter Rob Roblin has details. It was last night when State Police Helicopter Trooper 3 was returning from a medevac mission when suddenly a green laser illuminated the cockpit. Right now we're getting hit pretty good with a green laser. 90 Charles, we're at CJ. And I copy you're getting hit with a green laser. You're watching video of a helicopter being lasered from the ground. As you can see, in just a few seconds, a laser can blind the pilot, putting the aircraft in danger. And all of a sudden you get hit, it just wipes you right out, and you can no longer see anything inside the cockpit. It, it takes a couple seconds for you to get your eyesight back to normal to where you can actually see the gauges and see what's outside. Last night, a state police helicopter flying out of Frederick was hit by laser over Carroll County near Route 27 and Route 144. Police say the person aiming the laser at the helicopter turned out to be a 12-year-old boy. Danny Wolf, who flies for Baltimore County Police, has been hit by laser on two occasions and knows how serious it can be. Short-term effects of you can obviously, if you're temporarily blinded, lose control of the aircraft. Long term, you can have headaches and some permanent eye damage can also occur. If you got hit with a camera, you know, with a flash bulb real quick, and you know that instant blindness that you have for a couple seconds, well, figure that you're in a night environment. And then all of a sudden, it's a big flash in front of you, and then you have nothing. So if you have a laser pointer or your kids have a laser, pointing it at an aircraft is both a state and federal crime. Uh, any aircraft, it's a federal law, um, so you will be charged both locally and federally with the crime. We are getting hit with a green Bob Robin, WBAL-TV, 11 News.